Um, each month we take this opportunity to share with you and our viewing audience some of the great things that happen in our schools each and every day and some of the wonderful accomplishments of both our staff and our students. So each spring the board continues a long-standing tradition of recognizing each high school's honor graduates. So instead of asking the seniors and their families to come to our normal meeting place in City Hall, the school board is bringing its meetings to each high school auditorium. So tonight we're coming to you from Kings Fork High School and we'll be recognizing the honor graduates from the Bulldog class of 2017. In March and April we recognize Nancy and River and Lakeland honor graduates. We've asked each student to introduce their parents, share their college and career plans, and tell us about their fondest memory while a student in Suffolk Public Schools. So I'd now like to invite Kings Fork Principal Dr. Ronald Lee to start the instructions of tonight's honored guest. Thank you, and good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Uh, Dr. DeBransky, uh, Dr. Whitney, and honored school board uh, pulpit guests. I'm pulpit, I guess I think I'm in a church. <laughs> Sorry. I have to do that as a deacon a lot. <laughs> yes. Um, we are certainly very proud of our graduates. Uh, this is a very, very accomplished class. Uh, just to name a few schools that they've been accepted to, MIT, mm. wow. Howard. Wilberforce, Hampton, William and Mary, mm -hmm. Georgia Tech, Alabama, Michigan, Vanderbilt, Arizona State, the University of Miami, Virginia Tech, mm -hmm. the University of Virginia, <laughs> Maryland, and VMI, just to name a few. Mm -hmm. This is a very, very good group of young men and women. I'm very proud as their principal uh, to be able to present them to you tonight. Um, I am going to miss this group particularly because a lot of them have been with me for a very long time as, as I was their elementary school principal as well. So without further ado, I am going to introduce the Director of Guidance, Ms. Charlene Geraldine, uh, and she is going to introduce to you the 2017 class of Kings Fork High School Bulldogs. I am very proud and I know you'll be very proud when you hear these young people share with you what their future plans are. So without further ado, Ms. Geraldine. On behalf of the faculty, staff, and students at Kings Fork High School, thank you for recognizing the Kings Fork High School honor graduates this evening. Currently, we have 343 potential graduates in our class with 100 honor graduates. Now, these students have earned Yes, 100. That deserves some. <laughs> These students have earned at least a 3.0 or higher cumulative grade point average over their entire high school career. College acceptance letters have been coming in, and you've seen the wonderful uh, career wall that we have outside of the auditorium. Our students have been accepted at a wide range of colleges, including the University of Virginia, College of William and Mary, Virginia Tech, Christopher Newport University, James Madison, and Hampton University, along with George Mason University in Virginia. And out of state, they've been accepted at universities in Arizona, Florida, Massachusetts, North Carolina, South Carolina, Maryland, and Texas. We're covering the country. So far, our students have received over, hope I get this right, $2,446,343 in scholarships and grants, and the money is still coming in. All our students are very busy in school and community activities in addition to their rigorous academic courses. They volunteer as firemen, hospital workers, tutors, Sunday school teachers, and camp counselors. They volunteer for the Relay for Life, the March of Dimes, and raise money to support their school and community. While some people may be concerned about what the future will be like with this new generation, I can assure you that the future is in excellent hands. As we prepare to introduce our honor graduates, many of our honor graduates are busy on the athletic field or with other endeavors tonight. Now, I proudly present the Kings Fork High School class of 2017 honor graduates 
led by our valedictorian, Nadine Barakat, and our salutatoria, Alana Tillery. Nadine, before you get started, can you hold up one second? I'd like to ask all uh, honor graduates when they speak, please make sure the microphone is in front of you. And when you p recognize your parents with the parents, please stand so we can recognize you as well. Thank you. My name is Alana Tillery. My parents are Angela and Dennis Tillery. I plan to study engineering at the University of Maryland. And my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is going out to ice cream and dinner with my third grade teacher, Mrs. Stickles, after I earned enough AR points. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening. My name is Mackenzie Bennington, and my parents are Donise and Harold Bennington. I plan to attend Radford University in their Honors Academy. I will major in chemistry with a concentration in biochemistry for um, life sciences. Um, my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools was meeting my best friend Nicole in second grade who to this day we still talk every day and we still attend classes together. Oh, thank you. My name is Anthony. Can you hear me? No. My name is Anthony Bell. Uh, my father here is James Bell. And my career plans are to serve in the Air Force. And my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is being a part of the ROTC program. Hello, um, I am Abigail Bilby. And my parents are Sean Bilby and the Dana Bilby. <laughs> um, I plan to attend George Mason University where I will major in global affairs um, and hope to go into the humanitarian aid field and eventually the Peace Corps. Um, my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools was getting nominated for a scholarship based on character and merit by my guidance counselor, Ms. Coley, um, for my humanitarian work in Haiti following Hurricane Matthew. Thank you. Wonderful. Good evening. Good evening. My name is Trevor Rygart, and my parent who is here to share this moment with me tonight is Lisa Barnes. <laughs> my college or career plan is to attend a four-year college or university and major in computer science and minor in AP US Virginia government. And my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is meeting some of my favorite teachers. Hi, my name is Savannah Briggs, and my parents are Amy Briggs and Scott Briggs. My plans for after high school is to attend a CRISM Institute to become a master esthetician. And my fondest memory of Suffolk Public Schools was on my first day when I met my favorite teacher, Ms. Quantley, and her attitude and her um, character really set the tone for the rest of the year here. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'd like to remind the students to bring the microphone down so that we can hear you better, okay? Thank you. Is that good? Perfect. <laughs> yes. Good evening. My name is Angelo Cicchini, and my parents are Matt and Gwen Cicchini. <laughs> my plans for the future are to attend VMI and commission in the Air Force. And my fondest memory while attending pu Suffolk Public Schools is playing chess two times a week in the afternoons here at Kings Fork High School.
Good evening, my name is Kiera Crocker Adams. Um, my mother, Chastity Adams, is here. Um, I plan on serving in the United States Air Force and my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools was um, meeting my ROTC family and just making adventures with them. Hello, uh, my name is Keenan Dare and my parents are Shelly and Ronald Dare. And my college career plans are to major in business at, uh, at uh, ODU. And my fondest memory is probably my freshman year in my first day in high school. Good evening. My name is Selena Davis, and my parents are Katina and Daryl Davis. I plan to attend VCU and major in pharmacy. And my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools was making friends during my field hockey and tennis season and bonding on and off the field. And also the fifth grade ball that we had at McBen Junior Elementary. <laughs> Hello, my name is Rebecca Dixon, and my parents are Betty and Richard Dixon. I plan on attending Old Dominion University to double major in theater and English, and my fondest memory of Suffolk Public Schools is during my senior year, I volunteered at Oakland Elementary where I gained 452 hours of community service. <laughs> Hi, my name is Agnes Doce. My parents' names are Daniel and Juliet Doce. Um, I plan to go to school at Berea College in Kentucky and major in nursing and to go to medical school in the future to become a pediatric doctor. My fondest mem memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is playing tennis and eventually making captain. I also love being in Mr. Fike's AP government class. He's funny and he's interesting. And talking to Ms. Miller, my access advisor. Good evening. My name is Jordan Edler. My parents are Ernest and Eula Edler. I plan to go to Norfolk State to study nursing, and my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools will definitely be graduation. <laughs> Good evening, board. My name is Carly Folsom. My parents are Elaine and Michelle Folsom. This fall, I will be attending the University of Florida with a chemistry major on a pre-med track. And my fa uh, fondest memory is, uh, for all my swim people out in the audience, uh, accidentally swimming a 150 uh, fly, as well as setting f uh, french fries on fire in Ms. Kreiner's class for my uh, international baccalaureate thesis. <laughs> Good evening, my name is Rakia Freeman, and uh, my parents are John and Tiffany Freeman. I will be majoring in aerospace engineering at the University of Virginia, and hope to work for NASA one day. And my fondest memory while attending several public schools is building a dragster in my freshman technology, uh, technology foundations class. Good evening, my name is Tamara Giles, and my parents are James and April Dildy. I, I plan to attend Avery University to major in early childhood education and minor in theater art. My finest moment of attending Suffolk Public Schools is performing my first monologue in front of an audience and receiving my first scholarship. Good evening, my name is William Holloway. My parents are Reginald and Kyla Holloway. My career plans, I have enlisted in the United States Marine Corps and my fondest memory while attending some of the public schools would be the fun times in ROTC. Holloway. Mm -hmm. 
Good evening, my name is Alexis Jones and my parents are Paul and Kimberly Jones. I plan to attend Virginia Wesleyan College or Tidewater Community College, majoring in computer science and criminal justice. I hope to pursue a career with the FBI, and my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is winning the most improved athletic award for field hockey. Good evening, all. My name is Aaliyah King, and joining me this evening are my parents, Woodrow and Adrian King. I'm excited to say that I'll be furthering my education at the best university in Virginia, James Madison University. Yeah. <laughs> I have a passion and desire to pursue a career in business management, and I hope to one day obtain my Master's of Business, business Administration and become a Chief, Chief Executive Officer. Officer. One of my fond fondest moments with being in several public schools for my four years of high school is the numerous amount of volunteer activities I was able to participate in, some of which include the Learning and Enrichment for Academic Progress Elementary School program at Macbin Elementary and Elephant's Fork Elementary. These are just a few of the opportunities Suffolk Public School has allowed me to participate in, and I enjoy them all. Thank you. Good evening, my name is Maya Lewis, and my parents are Jerry and Sharonda Lewis. My college or career plans are that I plan to attend ODU, so Old Dominion University, and I plan on majoring in education and or music education. I want to be a music teacher because I love music and I want to share my love of music with children all around the world. My fondest memory would be going to Mount Zion because we were a small school and I met them as a school family and also meeting my best friend for now 12 years and we're still going strong and also meeting the beautiful late Miss Robinson. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Amisha Elise Miller. I'm the daughter of Michael and Adrian Miller. I was lucky enough to have my mother be my access counselor throughout high school. I will be attending the University of North Carolina in Greensboro on a full ride basketball scholarship. Oh. I will be starting. I will be starting June 14th for preseason workouts as well as starting my major, which will be biology. I will be taking extra classes during the summer, so I'm hoping to be done with my bachelor's in three years. I will be pursuing a career in veterinary medicine. My favorite memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is while I was attending Hill Point Elementary School, and we were blessed enough to receive an animal lab. This is my fondest memory because animals are definitely my passion, and I have also been back to volunteer and see the work that they have um, been doing on the school as well. Good evening, my name is Ian McBride. My parents are Mac and Rebecca McBride. My career plans after school is to attend the apprenticeship at Norfolk Naval Shipyard for welding. My fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is meeting new people and getting to experience new things. Good afternoon. My name is Chantel Morris. I'm the daughter of Andrea and James Watson Jr. and the late Shelton Morris. I will be attending Tidewater Community College and my major will be culinary arts and I hope to, to become a private chef and a pastry chef. And my fondest memory while attending Southern Public Schools is attending the Prudence Center and making new friends each year. Hello, I am Simon Munn. I'm with here tonight with my parents, Gary and Deborah Munn. I plan to attend James Madison University, uh, studying biology. And I'm um, kind of up in the air about whether I want to do pre veterinary or pre-dental right now. My fondest memory while attending public <laughs> Sorry, got my heart going here, sorry. Uh, while attending Suffolk Public Schools would have to be 
fulfilling my community service hours. Uh, I actually started with um, working on a mission trip in uh, the Eastern Shore, but I actually enjoyed that a lot, so I decided to continue it working at uh, Riddick's Folly during the, my next summer. And I think those two experiences have given me some of the best memories, not only of my high school experience, but probably some of the best memories you're going to have in my life. So thank you. Good evening. My name is Sydney Nichols, and I'm the daughter of Demita and Overton Nichols. I will be, um, I plan to attend North Carolina Wesleyan University. Um, I plan to major in criminal justice as well as further my athletic career in soccer. And my fondest memory of Suffolk Public Schools is my senior year being able to go to states in basketball. <laughs> Hi, my name is Nia Nickerson and my parents are James Nickerson and Bermuda Nickerson. My plans are to attend the Honors College at North Carolina A&T on a full scholarship and right. major in international business. And one of my fondest memories is meeting my second grade teacher, Miss Arrington, um, who really left an imprint on me very young. Good evening, my name is Ordera Ozo. My parents are Peter and Ngozi Ozo. My college or career plans are to attend Arizona State University and major in biochemistry with concentration in medicinal chemistry. And in the future, I will apply to med school and pursue a career in emergency room medicine. And I think my fondest memory while attending South Public Schools is probably playing in the Kings Fork Mighty Marching Bulldog Band. Hello, my name is Lauren Park. Um, and my parents are Kelly and Phil Park. My, my college plan is to attend the greatest school that I believe that is in this country, James Madison University. <laughs> um, I will be majoring in chemistry and I hope to further my career um, to gra at a graduate school at Virginia Tech and go into the research field. Um, I believe that my fondest memories here at Kings Fork are creating the friends that I have now, and one of them being Danielle Arzillo, being my roommate for college who is not here today, um, and re representing Kings Fork as an athlete here. And that's it. Hello, I am Ashanti Parker, and my parents are Reginald Wiggins and Latrice Parker, and I'd like to recognize my grandma who helped to raise me, Barbara Parker. Um, my college and career plans. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Are to go to Virginia Wesleyan College and major in business with a focus in accounting. And one day raise enough money to put myself to culinary art school and open my own bakery. <laughs> my fondest memory. <laughs> my fondest memory while in Suffolk Public Schools was winning first place at the Virginia TSA, um, the regional Tidewater TSA, um, uh, um, sorry, competition and debate with my favorite Madam President, Rakia Freeman. <laughs> Good evening, my name is Shantae Porter Anderson and my grandparents slash par um, parents are Kathleen Anderson and Alvin Anderson. For college, I plan to go to Liberty University and major in American Sign Language and Interpretation. And um, my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools would be making the greatest friends ever while also going to Mount Zion and being raised there as a family and building that you know friendship with other people as well. Thank you. Hello, my name is Tatiana Prilo, and I'm glad to introduce my parents, um, Wagnus Prilo and Tanya Prilo. 
I will be attending the College of William & Mary in the fall, and I will be uh, majoring in biology, and I'm gracious to say that I have a full scholarship there. Wonderful. And my fondest memories of Suffolk Public Schools has to be a part of Kingsforth Athletics, um, running track all four years, um, definitely the various field days at Northern Shores Elementary School, and uh, that's pretty much it. Thank you. Hello, my name is Stephen Ramlogan, and the parent that is with me tonight is Rhea Ramlogan. Um, I plan on majoring, dual majoring in biology and chemistry with a pre-med track at, uh, the universe, at Virginia Commonwealth University at, to pursue a career in emergency medicine. And um, my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is being able to present my chemistry extended essay um, at the International Baccalaureate Showcase with my, uh, in front of my IB peers. My name is Sarah Rhodes, and my parents are Benita and Randy Rhodes. My plans are to attend TCC Portsmouth campus and then later on transfer to either College of Charleston or CNU to become an art teacher or art therapist. And my fondest memory is going to Mount Zion Elementary School where I met my longtime best friend, Chante and Caitlin, and um, winning Best in Show at the Exhibit of Excellence and then school, Suffolk school. Why? <laughs> Hello, my name is Caleb Rivers, and my parents are Reginald and Tanya Rivers. <laughs> I plan on getting my bachelor's at the College of William and Mary, and where I plan on majoring in law and having a minor in business. And my fondest moment at Suffolk Public Schools was joining my school's DECA club and getting first in my district in the principles of business and finance. Uh, good evening, my name is Elena Rodriguez and my parents are Erica and Jose Rodriguez. I will be attending George Mason University with a major in criminology and a minor in law and society. And my fondest moment here at Suffolk Public Schools would be the continuous support from Ms. Jerlin and the access advisor, Ms. Miller. This is my first year at Kings Park High School. As a senior, I transferred from California Ooh. and transferring does mess up your school. And I am where I am today really because of Ms. Jerlin and Ms. Miller. They have supported me and they've influenced me in such an amazing way and I'm very grateful. Hello, my name is Museb Shambly. Um, my dad is Kareem Shambly. <laughs> my career plan and uh, college goal is to attend TCC for two years and transfer to VCU. I also want to become a director and make interesting films. Uh, my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is um, making friends, yeah, specifically um, being invited to a table and becoming more outgoing. Thank you. Hello, my name is Tierra Sharon, and my mother is Marthea Sharon. <laughs> my career plan is to attend ODU University and to major in public and environmental health and minor in international business and hopefully become an environmental affairs specialist. My fondest memory was meeting some of the greatest faculty and staff in the International Baccalaureate program and meeting some of my best friends. Hi, I'm Nicholas Shiflett, and my parents here, my parent here today is Nicholas Jones. All right, my college or career plans are to attend Old Dominion University with a major in, in biology to become a game warden in Virginia State. And my fondest memory 
and Suffolk Public Schools is attending the Air Force Junior ROTC program here at Kingsport High School from my first year to fourth year. Hello, my name is Paige Summers, and my parents that are here today is Tracy Summers and David Edmondson. And I just wanna say that mom, I love you, and I would not be up here if it wasn't for you. Aww. I will be attending the University of Virginia um, right. and having a major in chemistry. And my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools was getting the two mile track record here at Kings Fork High School. Good evening. Good evening. My name is Gabriel Tillery and I'm here tonight with my parent, my beautiful mother, Tashaya Tillery, and my family. And my career plan is attending TCC and then transferring to VCU for theater arts. And my fondest memory while attending Suffolk Public Schools is being crowned homecoming king for 2017 uh. at Kingsport High School. Good evening, school board members. My name is Jasmine Charter, and I'm the daughter of K Charlie Charter and Karen Shell. I am so pleased to stand before you with my fellow classmates as we celebrate our accomplishments. I also want to thank those who made it possible, you. Without the tough decisions you have made, I would not be furthering my career goal as a nurse at Radford University this fall. A very fond memory that I have attending Suffolk Public School includes meeting my lifelong role model, who was actually my fifth grade teacher, Ms. Jasmine Watts Freeman. I would like to thank you, the school board members, and, administrator, and administration for all the time and effort you put into your position, and which trickles down through our administration, our teachers, and us. I am indebted to you and past board members for your thoughtfulness. Thank you again. Hi, Grandma. <laughs> so my name is Alyssa, Bit Alyssa Vick, and um, I'm the daughter of Kim and Richie Vick. Um, okay. um, my plans for next year, I will be attending Radford University, double majoring in uh, communications and business management. Um, my fondest memory of Kings, well, Suffolk Public Schools is one, I met my best friend eighth grade year, and we will only be three hours apart come next year. Um, and also getting to work with Miss Miller all year because she did not let me quit on anything, and um, she was basically my second mama at school. So that was nice. Um, but yeah, I'm excited, so thank you. <laughs> Um, hello, my name is Tariq Wiggins, and I'm here with my parents, Lolita and Elwood Wiggins. Um, I plan to join the military and enlist into the United States Air Force, and my fondest memory here is probably particip participating inside the AFJROTC program and the band program. Hello, good evening. Um, my name is Eric Williams, and my mom has accompanied me tonight, Nicole Williams. I will be attending George Mason in the fall, go Patriots. And my fondest memories were um, when Mr. Pine had danced in class to make us remember that derivative equals gradient, derivative equals gradient. <laughs> And then another memory is that the time I realized that I did not, I could not um, cook when I made las pupusas um, from El Salvador in my Spanish class, and everyone hated them. <laughs> so, yes, thank you. Good evening. My name is Ramon Wright, and I'm here with my mother, Bernice Foster. I plan to attend Virginia Union on a full athletic basketball scholarship and studying electrical engineering. And my fondest memory is my sophomore year when we went to the States to the basketball championship.
I want to remind you that some of our honor graduates were unable to be here tonight due to other commitments, but their information is included in your package. Again, thank you for recognizing these outstanding students and the families who supported them. Good evening. I'd like to make a comment here. Board members, go ahead. I would. Go ahead. Um, there, there are so many. These, this is a fascinating class, and they're so, uh, I mean, I would like to praise all of you, but there are just a couple of people I'd like to uh, point out. Uh, for starters, Jasmine Trotter, I want to know who paid you to praise the school board. <laughs> uh, I also want to, the, the several people who uh, were, who went to Mount Zion, I hope you aren't holding it against us for closing that school, <laughs> uh, which we did the first year I was on the board. Uh, I'd, I'd like to uh, say also, there must be an unbelievably fantastic ROTC program, considering mm -hmm. the praise that uh, the, you who have been in that program have given it. I would like to congratulate that program. It's just, it has to be fantastic. And uh, finally, I'd like to say something to Simon Munn, who uh, talked about how much you enjoyed your uh, community service. I hope you will be able to speak to people in the future about the importance of doing this because it's, you know, by giving your time, so much comes back to you. And I think you have to actually experience it before you realize how valuable it is. Anyway, congratulations to all of you. I'd like to thank the administration and the guidance staff of Kings Fork High School for putting this all together this evening. I've been on the other side. I know it's not an easy task. And I just want to say how nice it was sitting up here watching the glow on parents' faces as they were introduced Absolutely. and their pride as they were snapping pictures of their graduate. It, it really warmed my heart. And congratulations to all the graduates of Kings Fork High School, and congratulations to the parents for your efforts in getting them to where they are today. Thank you. This is actually my favorite time of the year, watching graduations. I try not to cry while I'm doing it. Uh, on, on June 10th, you'll probably notice something. But at any rate, I just want to say, wow, you all have done some wonderful things. I am so impressed by what you've done, the things that you participated in. We hear complaints about community service, and you all came up and told us all the wonderful things you're doing. That is so impressive to me. In addition to your grades, your athletic uh, participation, and your other extracurricular activities make such a difference in a well-rounded student when you get ready to go to college and in life. So I just wish you all the blessings possible, and I'm just impressed. To those who are going to the military, my prayers are with you, and we thank you for your service, for, for your willingness to serve your country. And uh, just parents, I know you must be beaming because I am, and they're your children. Thank you. Um, I'd like to congratulate the parents. I think you've done an excellent job. I see why Dr. Lee said this was a group he didn't want to let go. Um, it makes me feel uh, reassured, as he is, and others, that uh, we're living in a time when we know that we have young people that are going to step up and do what they need to do for their country and for their fellow man. I was very impressed by the uh, remarks about community service, and uh, I hope you will go out and spread that message to other people, as Ms. Bouchard and others have said. Um, we know that that is probably where you will gain more of your life experiences and where you will be able to take those and sometimes uh, it will determine where you go in the future and the life that you will lead in the future. Uh, I did hear a few people mention that they were going into education and that is encouraging. A few, as I said, too, I believe. But I do hope that you will continue to be uh, invested in our community whatever way 
uh, you go. And we do bless you, and um, we pray for you and your future. Thank you. I, too, would like to I, congratulate sorry. all of uh, the students who are going to the various colleges and universities. Uh, you have chosen some very good schools. <clears throat> And uh, one stood out more than any other to me personally, <laughs> was the right. I am a 50-year graduate of Virginia Union University, and congratulations for, chosen, for choosing that school for playing basketball. Thank you very much. I'd like to say congratulations to all of the, the graduates that are here at Kings Fork High School. Uh, a lot of times, you know, you work hard in a position and you feel as if you're doing something great. But tonight we feel even better because there was a young lady who came forward to thank the school board. <laughs> and we are excited about that. We don't always get a thank you for all that we do. So we really do. We look forward to you in the future coming back, letting us know where you are and what you're doing in life, and we wish you the best that life has to offer. Congratulations. I'd like to recognize those people that are responsible for this graduation. Would the parents of all graduates please stand up at this time? Parents of graduates, please stand up. Let's, let's recognize them.